everyone, this is Chocowit here, and today I am going to be presenting to you my top 10 daggers of Skyrim. This list was suggested to me by Icy Anime, so thanks for watching my videos, dude. Kicking off our list at number 10, I have chosen the Glass Dagger. This dagger begins to appear around Skyrim once the Dragonborn has reached a level 20. It does a base damage of 9, and to smith it, it requires a smithing level of 70 and the Glass Smithing perk. For number 9, I have chosen Valder's Lucky Dagger. This unique steel dagger is gifted to the Dragonborn by Valder after the quest Hunter and Hunted is complete, after helping him defeat the Spriggans that have infested Moss Mother Cavern. Though it does a base damage of 5, it also has a 25% chance of dealing a critical hit. 8. Kavozine's Fang This unique dagger was used by the Dragon Priest to collect Dragon Heart skills. This dagger is acquired during the quest Alteration Ritual spell given by Tolfdir at the College of Winterhold once the Dragonborn has reached a level 90 in Alteration. It does base damage of 6, but it can be used to harvest Dragon Heart skills that are valued at 250 gold. 7. The Ebony Dagger This beautifully designed dagger does a base damage of 10 and requires a smithing level of 80 and the Ebony Smithing perk to create. This dagger will begin to appear around Skyrim as random loot when the Dragonborn has reached a level 35. 6. Stallroom Dagger This dagger comes with the Dragonborn DLC and does a base damage of 10. What makes this dagger special is frost enchantments will be 25% stronger than other materials. They can be found as random loot or they can easily be purchased from Glover Mallory or Baldur Eider Shaper in Solsheim. To craft, they require a smithing level of 80 and the Ebony Smithing Perk. 5. Daedric Dagger this horrific dagger does a base damage of 11 and will start to appear throughout Skyrim once the Dragonborn has reached a level 46. It can also be forged with a smithing level of 90 and a Daedric smithing perk. For number 4, I have chosen Maroon's Razor. This is a Daedric artifact and quest reward for Maroon's Dagon's quest, Pieces of the Past. It does a base damage of 11 and hits have a small chance to instantly kill a target. This dagger can only be obtained if the Dragonborn elects to kill Silas in Dagon's honor. 3. Keening this is a unique Dwemer dagger that deals a base damage of 8 with the chance to absorb 10 points of health, magicka, and stamina upon strike. It can be acquired during the quest Arniel's Endeavor in a Radiant Location, and was created by Lord Kegnarak long ago. 2. The Dragon Bone Dagger This dagger does a base damage of 12 and requires a smithing level of 100 and the Dragon Armor perk to create. And for number 1, I have chosen the Blade of Woe. This dagger is given to the Dragonborn by Astrid upon the completion of the quest Death Incarnate, or can be obtained by killing Astrid in the abandoned shack during the quest with friends like these. Upon strike, it will deal 12 points of damage and absorb 10 points of health. Long ago, during the Oblivion Crisis, this blade was given to the Hero of Kavach by Lucien Lachance, and the Night Mother blessed it with a deadly power once they took on the role of listener. I hope you've enjoyed my list and found it helpful. Still looking for those questions for the Q&A, be as creative as you like. Remember to like and subscribe. Bye.